all right guys splits here and i'm gonna show you guys how to start your own youtube gaming channel just by using your ps4 so before we get started i'm gonna help you guys out so if you guys want to grow your channel make sure you guys comment down below and just saying like hey check me out and you guys can like watch each other's videos and who knows maybe i'll check out your channel so uh comment down below your channel name in the comments down below so yeah all right so you guys know that i have over 100k subs and i can just tell you guys straight up that the ps4 is like the best thing to start out your channel like it has everything you need you guys can record straight off the ps4 no capture card needed you guys can edit by using the share factory app you guys can see right there and you can just straight upload it to youtube and it and the recorder on the ps4 like the quality is actually really good so i'm gonna show you guys like the best uh recording settings also how to edit and upload it to youtube and start um growing your channel and start doing it so let's start i'm gonna start uh showing you guys how to actually record your gameplay so i'm gonna test it out on fortnite so let's get right into it all right so i'm gonna show you guys the best recording settings on the ps4 so if you press the share button you guys will see this will pop up and if you go down to sharing and broadcast settings this is where we go into the recording settings so all you really need to focus on is length of video clip so if you think about uh uploading a like a long video you guys can record up to 60 minutes so that's nice and then you want to go to audio sharing settings and if you guys want to record like your microphone so like like it records the gameplay and your mic at the same time you guys can just check that and then share party audio like if you're in a if you're in a party with your friends and you, and you want the recorder to record their voices you would check that so and then this one you don't have to worry about that because that's for live streaming and other than that those are like the best settings possible on your ps4 so i'm going i'm gonna go to a game real quick and show you guys how to actually record your gameplay all right guys so you guys can see i'm in a game right now so all you have to do to record is double tap the share button so i'm gonna do that and you guys can see on the top left corner it is recording that's the recording symbol so now from here everything is being recorded in full hd like the best possible settings so yeah this is really cool so uh, I'm just going to drop real quick and then once I land, I'm just going to stop recording, which I will show you guys how to do that. Alright guys, so before I die, uh, to actually stop your recording, you want to double tap the share button again. And once you do that, you guys will see on the top left corner, the video clip is now saved to my capture gallery. So now you guys have everything that you recorded is now on your PS4 and oh crap i'm getting shot at hold up that's what he gets for interrupting my video like maybe he should watch this video on how to grow his channel because he just got freaking owned all right so oh my god i'm getting shot at again okay rip all right anyways i was gonna say one more thing all right so now that you guys recorded your game it's time to edit so I'm gonna quit Fortnite and then you guys will see uh, this app right here it's called share factory this is like the perfect editing for editing your videos on the ps4 uh, so you can strict you can straight uh, upload it to YouTube just from this app so if you guys don't have this just go to your library and then go to applications and then you guys should see it right there it's called share factory all right, so let's just uh, start the app and I'll show you guys how to actually edit. All right, guys, so here's the layout for Share Factory. Um, you just wanna focus on videos. And once you're here, go to new project and then you'll see these themes. It doesn't really matter which one you pick cause you're gonna delete them anyway. So just pick whichever one. And then you'll see these check marks. You just wanna uncheck those because you don't really need those. And then you guys can see this is the clip that I recorded right there. It's the first one. And then from here, you would just want to press square to start the project. And then you can you guys can rename it. All right, so I just named it Fortnite. And then you just want to press continue. 
And then this is the whole layout of Share Factory. It's actually a really simple layout and easy to edit here. So I'll show you guys the basic basics. All right, guys, so if you guys press X, you guys can see that you can add things. So you can add a clip, a screenshot. If you guys wanna do like a commentary over your gameplay, this is where you would go. Just press X and it'll start recording your voice. If you guys wanna add music, you can to your clips, uh, add overlay. This is basically for making a thumbnail. If you guys want to learn how to make thumbnails on Share Factory, I do have a video on that. And then add filter. You don't have to worry about this one because this is basically like Instagram for your videos, but I don't recommend that. Add layout. Don't worry about that. And then square is where all the is where all the editing magic happens. And all you really need to know is how to split the clip and how to delete the clip. So that's basically all editing is is splitting it and deleting a clip so how long is this I think this is like a minute so I'm just gonna like edit the part where like I jumped out so all right so somewhere right here is where I jumped out so I'm just gonna split the clip from here so split it split clip press X to confirm it and then you guys can see I don't want all this boring stuff because this is just me waiting in the lobby so I'm going to delete it by pressing square and then confirm to delete it. All right. So yeah, I can see when I play a clip, it now starts where I flew off the bus all the way till I ended the clip. So which was right there. So that's basically all you have to do is how to edit is just splitting the clip and deleting it. So once you do all that, you just want to press triangle and it will upload to YouTube so I'm gonna wait for this to render to actually show you guys how to do all that all right so the rendering is about to end all right right there is it's finished so from here you just want to press share and then you guys will see these four just want to press YouTube because that's where you want to upload it and then from here you just want to fill out your title and description and then just scroll down and then you guys just want to press share and then it will automatically upload to your YouTube channel. All right, guys. So hopefully these tips helped you out. I wish you guys good luck to getting those milestones like 100 subscribers or even a thousand. And maybe you guys, once you hit those milestones, you like you can come back to this video and be like, hey, Splits, thank you so much for helping me grow my channel. And yeah, that'd be pretty cool. So yeah, guys, good luck on your channels. Like I said in the beginning, if you guys want to write a comment, just say check me out so you guys can get a good head start on people watching your videos and start gaining subscribers. So yeah, man, you just got to love this. Like I love helping people out. Like look at me. I, I made a video on how to like grow your YouTube channel because it's just something that I like to do. I like helping out. So hopefully you guys enjoy making those YouTube videos. And yeah, guys, subscribe if you're new. Give a like if you enjoyed. And yeah, guys. Thanks for watching.